Hi guys, this is June 2018, paper 2, variant 3. Question 7. The diagram shows a uniform meter rule pivoted at the 30 centimeter mark. The rule balances when a weight of 6 in newton is hanging from the 0 mark and the weight of 2 newton is hanging from the 70 centimeter mark and is asking what is the weight of the rule. To answer the question, we highlight some keywords like the uniform meter rule and the 30 centimeter mark and balances and weight of 6 in Newton and the zero mark and the weight of 2 Newton and the 70 centimeter and the weight of the rule. Actually, the weight of the rule is acting at the center of mass and the center of mass, the point at which the, the whole mass of the meter rule is acted on. Uh, the middle or the halfway, um, the weight is exactly is acting at the 50 centimeter mark. The halfway is set from the zero centimeters to the hundred centimeter. To answer the question from one keyword, which is that the rule balances according to the principle of moment, the total total clockwise moment equal to the total anticlockwise moment. And I'm going to zoom in the diagram itself. This is the side of the clockwise here, and the left side, which represents the anti clockwise. You know the formula for calculating any moment or turning effect of a force, which is the force or the line of action of the applied force times the perpendicular distance from the pivot here. So from the anti clockwise one, so it's a six. Uh, Newton times at 30 centimeters and this one for the anticlockwise at the left side and equals two because of having two forces and uh, from the pivot so the weight which is symboled by the letter W times the 20 centimeter which is actually the distance between or displacement between the 50 and 30 centimeters 50 and 30 centimeters plus the 2 newton which is the applied force because of this weight and times the 40 centimeters which is from 70 to 30 this one is 40 centimeters okay for the second part which is the 6 times the 30 which is 180 and equals w times the 20 and plus 2 times 40 which is 80 how to answer this part take the 80 from the right side and to the left side so by subtraction changing the sign of the plus to the negative one so the subtraction 180 minus 80 which is 100 equals to the W times the 20 and now we are going to divide both sides by 20 and finally they cancel out the 20 and 20 at the right side and the 0 and 0 for the left side from 120 so 10 divided by 2 which is 5 Newton so for this reason the answer is gonna be uh, 5 Newton which represents the weight as I said. Thank you. Now, say my name.